Hi, my name is Arjun Steekstra. I'm the Director of National Sales for Marine Leisure Diesel for Volvo Penta. I'm here today with the uh, Southport 30 FE DPI with our Volvo Duoprop DPI drive. One of the first things you'll notice about this boat is we were able to get a nice wide open transom here, no, no engines in the way. We put a nice big swim platform back here, but the swim platform is to your liking. You can change it, shorten it, leave it as long as this. Um, it gives you a lot of versatility. If you're just going to the beach, if you're divers, if you're fishermen, it's a fantastic platform with all the access to the water that we've uh, given this boat. You'll notice we have a nice squared off transom here. Um, we actually did a jack shaft on this boat. And what that means is we put the engine underneath this console, and then we ran a drive shaft back to the Aquamatic stern drive underneath the transom here. It's a D6, which is our proven engine that we've had. Uh, uh, it's going on 20 years now, believe it or not. It's a fantastic engine. It's probably the best engine I would say, and it's in its class in the marketplace today. We ended up moving the engine underneath this console to open up the back of the boat. You'll see one of the ways that, that we've improved the D6 over prior engines is we've put all the service points on top. So right in the very forward, you'll see the C strainer, then you'll see the fuel filter, then you'll see the oil filters. Everything's on top of the engine. There's a centrifugal, uh, filter on the side, no need for valve adjustments on this engine. So really nice compact installation with all your service points up top on the engine. A couple of cool features on this boat, it's a single engine, but um, we actually added a bow thruster and we added the ability to do joystick driving with a single engine by integrating the bow thruster. This actually won us an innovation award at Miami last year. Um, and then the other thing that we've added to the joystick uh, docking feature is we've added joystick driving. And joystick driving now lets you actually shift and throttle the boat right from the joystick. You put it in the forward and then you can either hold the lever down or each little bump of the lever is 50 RPMs. Now if you happen to want to not use the docking on the joystick, we also have a thruster only button here. So if you wanted to use the wheel and the throttles, and you just wanted to have your thruster, we have a thruster only button. For the uh, joystick driving, you hit the button with the arrows and you'll see on the screen, on the right side here, you can, you can see the reverse neutral forward. Now I'm in neutral. To go through reverse, you just hold it back, get into neutral, go into reverse. And you can actually do a crash stop from this. So you can go from full forward wide open throttle to full reverse wide open throttle um, right with a joystick. The engine will, will ramp down, go through neutral, go into the reverse and then ramp back up. So a real nice feature, you can, you can stop this boat in less than three boat lengths. One of the other things that we also have the ability to do because of our new drive, what we call low speed and other people call a trolling valve, so we can creep this boat forward while the engine's engaged. So for around the dock and tight areas, it's, it's really nice to have that, that really low, slow, forward or reverse speed. But for those of you who are fishermen, it lets you troll with this boat. If you're up in the Northeast, you can feather, feather in front of a rip and stay in gear the whole time. If you're offshore and you're slow trolling, goggle eyes, you'll be able to creep forward and just live line your live bait right off your riggers. It's a fantastic feature. We brought it down so you can have it in a smaller fishing boat. It's really a fuel efficient machine. At 37 miles an hour, you're getting about 2.3 miles to the gallon. And just a fantastic riding boat. Putting the weight in the center, our large diameter propellers, the massive amount of torque that we put out at lower RPMs with this engine, lets you run this boat through much heavier seas and in a much more comfortable way. So glad you guys could join us today on the uh, Southport 30 FE DPI.